Most people would agree that compared to a lot of places in the country, the weather in Waco, especially in the winter, is pretty good. Snowfall is rare and the number of sub-freezing days are pretty small. However, in the course of Waco's history, Mother Nature showed that especially in Texas, the weather is never that predictable and anything can happen. It was in 1899 that Texas experienced one of the coldest Februarys in history. Although weather records don't exist for Waco that year, articles describe how the Brazos River froze over as the mercury fell to minus 23 degrees at Tulia between Lubbock and Amarillo. Waco did experience another sub-zero winter when officials recorded a minus five degree reading in January of 1949. Before the construction of dams on the Brazos River at Whitney and Lake Waco on the Bosque River, the Brazos overflowed into downtown and East Waco many times. Major flood occurred in May of 1885 that damaged the east side of the then five-year-old suspension bridge. Other floods in December of 1907, 1913, 1918, and May of 1936. Waco's greatest single rainfall event occurred during the most deadly tornado in Texas history on May 11, 1953. 7.18 inches were recorded, along with the loss of 114 lives and over $41 million in property damage. The hottest official temperature in Waco was 112 degrees, recorded in 1969. 